I flew over a couple of days ago to London. Um, I actually quite like airports, mainly because the funniest thing I've ever seen happened in an airport. It was in Gatwick. There was a Ryanair plane and an Aer Lingus plane going from adjacent gates back to Dublin at the same time. And the Ryanair plane was delayed and the Aer Lingus plane was on time. And Aer Lingus started to take the piss out of Ryanair <laughs> in their announcements. It was magnificent. <laughs> All they did was make the announcements just after Ryanair. That was it. So it was like, ping bong. Ryanair would like to apologise for the late departure of flight FR122 back to Dublin. Uh, it will be a considerable delay as the aircraft has not left Dublin yet to get here. I'd like to apologise once again for this considerable delay. Bing bong! Aer Lingus are delighted to announce <laughs> the on time departure of flight EI, EI, all back to the homeland. <laughs> You get what you pay for, I suppose. <laughs> and they kept doing it. Bing bong! This is a Ryanair gate change announcement. We're going through gate B12 and the aircraft does land. B12. Bing bong! Aer Lingus would like to remind Ryanair that they can use our gate as we'll be finished with it in about five minutes. <laughs> Only for our flight will commence in order of height. Feck it, why not try something new? We've loads of time. We have loads of time. <laughs> Aer Lingus would like to ask Ryanair, would they like us to leave a key out for them, as it'll be very late. <laughs> By the time they get to Dublin Airport, your dinner's in the oven. Please don't wake up the sniffer dog. The alarm code is 1916, as always. <laughs> what they should have done was lull them into a false sense of security. No announcements for about 20 minutes, and then hit them with, bing bong. Mary, it's my turn. I know I'm going to... <laughs> <clears throat> Aer Lingus has read the recent report of the British Geological Society stating due to tectonic activity in the Earth's crust, the island of Britain is moving closer to the island of Ireland at a rate of one inch per year, and we think that Ryanair passengers might be better off <laughs> waiting for those two to join. <laughs> and walking home at this stage. <laughs> it was absolutely hilarious. Would have been funnier if I wasn't on the feckin' Ryanair plane. <laughs> Part 